so the subject is, with this particular mark, you can't buy or sell. Can somebody tell me what a radio frequency chip has to do with that? My hand is paying for everything today. I can't believe you just paid with this hand. Like, you just literally put your hand up, I, and you're good to go. Like, that's crazy. Hi, my name's Charlie Warzel. I'm a senior writer with BuzzFeed News. And uh, in order to see what the future of money looks like, I decided to live for a month uh, just paying for things with my phone. And somewhere along the line, I ended up getting a microchip implanted inside my hand to see if I could be uh, the first person in the world to uh, pay for something out in the real world using uh, just their... A radio frequency identification is meant as what? A GPS. That's the find that's location. That's Where's my dog? My girl, a sister wrote me and said, my dog has an RFID chip. I said, well, maybe he can go buy some land for you. <laughs> oh, yeah! You're an idiot. A couple weeks into my experiment, uh, I ended up going to Sweden. Sweden happens to be way far ahead of the United States when it comes to uh, getting rid of cash. I ended up uh, meeting with some people who are really active in the biohacking community and found that you could actually implant an RFID NFC chip in your hand. So take a deep breath with me and exhale. And so I figured if I could put it in my hand, maybe I'd be able to pay for something with my hand. That was it. Breathe. Yeah. <laughs> Keep breathing. How's it feel? It's like pinchy. It definitely hurt like way more than they said it was going to. It looks sort of like a grain of rice or like a pill that's in my hand. I think the idea of using a microchip implant in one's hand to be able to make a payment. When you see Israelites, dumb, unlearned Israelites, say the mark of the beast is a microchip they got it from Christianity. Oh yeah! You're an idiot. Have you ever seen people that has had their arms amputated? How are they gonna get the chip? <laughs> oh yeah! You're an idiot. I can't believe you just paid with this hand. Like you just literally put your hand up I, and you're good to go. Like that's crazy. Now, let's get to some scriptures now. Let's go to... And he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark on their right hand and on their foreheads and that no man might buy or sell, save that he that had the mark, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. Here is wisdom. Let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, and his number is six hundred threescore. And the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast in his image, and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hands, the same shall drink the wine of the wrath of God, which is poured out without mixture into the cup of his indignation. And he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. And the smoke of their torment ascendeth up for ever and ever. And they have no rest day nor night, who worship the beast and his image, and whosoever receiveth the mark of his name.